So to get code deploy working with your computing um, powers, you're gonna need two things. You're gonna need the code deploy agent. I always think this is pre-installed on Amazon Linux one and two, but it's not. Uh, so what this is, it's just a service. It's like a binary that you, uh, it's actually written in Ruby, but you have to install Ruby on your server and then download the script, uh, script, install it. And then what that will do is it will have the code deploy agent continuously running and it's going to uh, report back to code deploy the progress of um, when you run the, the lifecycle hooks and it installs all the steps. Uh, the other component to it is you need to create a code deploy service role. Um, and uh, this is pretty easy through the IM console. If you just go to, uh, if you choose code deploy, they have some preset ones for you. And what this does is it gives access to things like auto scaling groups, CLB, uh, and things like that. I say you may need to create it because I think in some cases you might not need it, uh, but this allows code deploy to um, create an additional auto scaling group and like shift traffic between elastic load balancers. So these are the two things you'll need to set up, um, which is not very clear um, when you're using code deploy.